guys, Leanne Bartlett here for today's video and today I wanted to actually share with you all a bit more about my story. Now I have mentioned on some of my other videos that I will be doing some or I have already started doing some, some live broadcasts on Facebook uh, which is completely out of my comfort zone uh, but wanted to you know keep pushing myself, keep getting out of the comfort zone, keep moving forward you know, keep adding value and providing value to all of you guys. So thank you for, for watching. And yeah, just wanted to, to really just, you know, take it to that whole next level. So, you know, there's a lot of you out there that wouldn't know much about my story. And I would definitely, you know, share some more of it as we go along. Would love for you to, uh, you know, follow me on um, Facebook as well. I have a few Facebook pages you know, jump onto my live broadcasts, you know, ask questions, you know, share all that kind of jazz. So definitely, you know, want you guys to participate for sure. But just to give you a bit of a, a rough rundown on, on my story. So I, uh, I am now 37. I have two children. They're now uh, eight and nine. Um, I have a husband as well. He's a chiropractor. And my first career, so my first major career that I had, I actually owned my own business. So I started my own business when I was 21. I actually brought my first apartment as well in Surface Paradise when I was 21. So definitely had the entrepreneur spirit from young. Um, I actually, even before that, um, designed a logo and some business cards and stuff for my parents' business. So you know, had some great influence from them, you know, about owning my own business. So yes, yeah, so I started my own business very young. And, you know, prior to that, I'd done quite a few things. I'd been a, a tour guide and an office manager on the Aquabus. So I don't know if you've seen the, the bus that drives into the water there in Surface Paradise. So I did that. You now I've worked as a short order cook in a cafe. So I've done, you know, quite a few things. I actually worked um, Hungry Jacks when I was still at school. So I actually worked um, quite a few hours uh, when I was still um, at school. So, you know, very uh, dedicated, motivated, let's put it that way. So I started my first business and when I was 21, as I mentioned. So it was basically building websites for small to medium businesses, uh, graphic design stuff, so designing logos and business cards and all that kind of stuff. And that was definitely my passion. Uh, so started there, I uh, then came across and met uh, a business partner um, who we went into business together and, you know, we did quite okay. Um, we were very different people. I was more the, the back-end design kind of side, wasn't very, um, let's say, wasn't the best person talking to people, that kind of jazz, that wasn't my thing. Her side was more the, you know, yes, I, uh, you know, more the salesy kind of person, if you put it that way. So yeah, so we got together and we made some pretty bad decisions. We, you know, we held an event and some other things. So lost quite a, a few hundred thousand dollars. Um, she then left um, and then I basically had to, uh, so I sack all the staff. I think at that time we had about eight staff members, had to sack the staff, move the business to my home and pretty much start from scratch at that point. Um, that's when I then joined and became part of a franchise. Uh, and that was that was a really great experience. You know, the franchise owners, all the, the people at the franchise were absolutely awesome. I really loved working with them. But I, I soon realized that I was more the one that I wanted to kind of, you know, franchise is great and it's great that there's a system and stuff in place, but I'm more the person that wants to be in charge. You know, I don't like necessarily following the system I like to actually create my own system in my own business more to the point like um, you know I want to be more the innovator if that makes sense so um, so yeah so I ran that in total owned my own business um, in the website kind of arena for 10 years and definitely learned a lot of stuff um, definitely had some big wins had some big losses you know all of that um, you know, we were creating quite great results by the time that I sold my business. But really by that stage, you know, after 10 years, it really wasn't my passion anymore. So I stumbled across a, a home-based business based in personal development. And personal development is absolutely something I love. And I really had gotten into that probably for about uh, two years, two and a half years before I sold my franchise. And you know, so thinking great, I can, you know, have a business in something that I really, really love. So 
I actually started my business that I'm now running. I've been doing that for over seven and a half years. Uh, so I started it part time alongside my franchise and so built it up. It took me a couple of years to sell my franchise. So really had a big amount of time to be able to build my, my other business up, which is what I'm doing now full time. So yeah, happy to say, um, yeah, was I hugely successful out of the gate? Absolutely not. Um, but definitely have grown. You know, I, I now, um, as of last year, top earner in the company. I find out again this in the next seven days whether I've done it again this year, which cross fingers, hopefully I have. But, you know, really, even if I haven't, I'm still super, super excited about what I've been able to create here in my life for, for myself, for my family, for my friends. You know, we've done some amazing things, you know. Yes, financially, I've totally just blown what I used to do out of the water. Like I literally used to pay myself about 30000 a year in my franchise because I had such huge debt from those last those past losses and stuff like that that I had to pay out. You know, when I sold my franchise, I pretty much paid out debt and that's all I had after 10 years. You know, in my business here, I wake, I make more, way more than 30000 you know, multiply that every single month, you know, and I feel what I do now is it's not even hard work. Like I work hard, but it doesn't feel like that to me. Like it feels like I'm doing something that I'm really excited about. I'm really passionate about, you know, I, I get to help people change their life. And, you know, I've seen hundreds and hundreds of people do that over the seven and a half years, you know, not everybody, because not everybody has the drive and motivation to do what's required. But those that actually put the work and effort in, wow, it's it's so rewarding to me to be able to really, I suppose, guide people down the path I've taken to create the results they want in their life and to really change every aspect. You know, I've not only changed our life financially, but I've changed it in other areas, our relationships, you know, my fitness, my health, you know, just everything in my life has changed since, you know, starting on this path. Um, you know, so is it possible for you guys? Absolutely. It's possible for anybody that is really serious. So you've, you've got to make that decision that you're serious about your goal and do not let anything get in your way. That's it. You know, nothing in your way. You know, if you wake up tired or sick, well, you still got to do the work that's required. You know, you can have do a bit less that day and do more the next day. But you don't just go, oh, I can't be bothered today and, you know, just go back to bed. You know, if you're really on the path to creating what you really want in life, you're going to do what's required. You know, you're not going to let anything get in your way. And those are the people that I love working with. Um, so, yeah, if you're one of those people, absolutely message me. I'd love to, to have a chat for sure. But you know what? Our business is not for everybody. And I'm not looking to work with anybody either. You know, I love, you know, being able to mentor and, and coach and really help people that are, you know, have that same drive and motivation as I do. So, you know, for us, you know, we've, we love to travel. You know, I've literally taken my mum, my dad, my children, my husband, even my husband's mum, we've taken over on a trip with us as well. You know, I just love what we've been able to, to do and experience. You know, it's stuff that I would have never even imagined ever doing, uh, especially back when I was running my other franchise. It's not stuff that it was even on the, the cards. You know, we've just had some amazing experiences and we've got more planned. You know, we've got some plans coming up just in the next few months. I think in the next two months, I've got like five trips booked, which is pretty cool. Like these are more local ones. And then we're going back overseas earlier in the year. But, you know, I just I just love that I have that flexibility to work my business from wherever. And, you know, I'm able to create the finances to do what we want to do, you know. So um, that's that's pretty much me. But, look, I would say the, the best thing that's happened really, yes, is finding this business. But, but two is just taking, you know, as I say, the bull by the horns and just running with it and just keep running with it and running with it. And every day... I wake up, I, I'm excited about what's on the horizon and, you know, it doesn't feel like work to me. It actually feels like, you know, I'm just jumping on the phone, chatting with, you know, friends and, but you know, these are people I've never met before, but, you know, I seem to be attracting people that are, you know, on the same page as me. So 
Yeah, that's. Uh, I hope you guys uh, learnt something from that. And if anything, um, if you have any questions or you'd like to know anything else about my story, um, absolutely would would love to share it with you. I am going to be, as I mentioned, doing my live um, video podcasts from the fa- one of my Facebook pages. So the Facebook page to go to uh, is facebook.com slash loving life now and then the number two. And uh, join me there Tuesday, 8.30 p.m. Queensland time, or that would be the same as 6.30 a.m. Eastern time. So uh, love you guys. Thanks for, for watching, and I will see you on the next video. Bye for now. Mm-hmm.